Okay, so what are game mechanics? This is actually a really difficult thing to explain, and I've looked all over the internet trying to find some existing web page or video I could use in this class to explain it. But in the end, I really didn't find anything, so I decided I would have to make my own. Now, why is it so hard to explain game mechanics to someone else? It's because there's no real agreement between academics or game designers on what mechanics actually are. We don't have a single definition that's, well, definitive. On the other hand, if you use the term game mechanics in the presence of other game designers, generally people will know what you're talking about. It's one of those words that we all just kind of understand intuitively from the context that we've seen it used in. Sometimes it's used interchangeably with goals or objectives. Although goals and objectives are somewhat related terms, they aren't really mechanics. At least, I don't think they are. So, let's talk about the definition given in Scott Rogers' Level Up, The Guide to Great Video Game Design. Rogers says that game mechanics are an item or element that players interact with to create or aid with gameplay. And his examples are moving platforms, opening doors, rope swings, and slippery ice. Well, that definition is actually kind of confusing because it makes it sound like a mechanic is some sort of object in the game, and that's not really it. The mechanic isn't just the moving platform itself, it's also the interaction we have with the moving platform. So when we talk about moving platforms as a mechanic, we intuitively understand that we are talking not just about platforms, but about jumping across them to other platforms, or running across them, falling off of them, whatever it is you actually do with a moving platform. Sometimes we even talk about interactions by themselves as mechanics, like Mario's jumping mechanics, or about Portal's portal shooting mechanic. But that's probably not quite right either. You still need the platform to jump across, or the wall to shoot the portal into. So you might say that mechanics here are actually jumping across moving platforms, or shooting portals into walls or jumping on top of an enemy to defeat it because that's not really the same mechanic as jumping across a platform. It might be the same button you're pushing to jump, the same control, but you're interacting with something different. This is all kind of based on my own intuitive understanding of what a game mechanic is and the various definitions of the term mechanic that I've come across. I think in a sense, game mechanics are actually what they sound like. The mechanics of a game are the parts that combine to make it work, kind of like the cogs and gears inside a mechanical watch. The one definition that I came across on the internet that I thought was pretty spot on can be found on the Valve Developer Community page about mechanics in Portal 2. It says, a game mechanic is an interaction between the player and one or more game elements. So again, we have two things going on here. Game elements, like what Scott Rogers talked about in his definition, and the player interaction with those elements. 